Welcome back to another episode, folks. Uh, we have a very highly requested video for definitely, you today. Definitely an exciting time. Uh, it's a boring time, but an exciting time because you guys now can pick up some brand new baits for 2020. Uh, show season has arrived. We're here. We got what's <laughs> new for 2020. Um, let's just jump right into this. Probably the biggest thing I'm the most excited absolutely, to talk about is the new musky rods from Chaos Tackle. This is going to be Gosh. the 2020. It's nuts. It absolutely is. A cr when you guys come to these shows and you pick this thing up, you are going to just be wowed. Um, it is so light. That's nuts. This is the Assault Stick 2020, it's called. Don't worry, guys. They still make the uh, original, the green rods, yep. if you will. Uh, which were the 190 price point. Uh, these are going to be a little more yeah. uh, spendy. They're going to be in the 350 range for these. Um, but what does 350 get you? It's nuts. I mean, first off, it's going to be telescoping, and just it's just amazing when it's paired with your reel. You'll be like, wow, that's actually really, really. It's light. like a bass rod. It's really like a bass rod. Um, all high component parts are high. Mm. <laughs> I mean, uh, yeah, put that in there. <laughs> yeah. SIC guides, premium grade cork. Um, we've also got, um, oh yeah, we've got a hole drilled in the trigger, right here, so you can actually whack Robbie in the face. Yep. No, what you can do with this is hook your lure instead of hanging it on the hook, which it contains that as well. There you go. So there's your hook storage right there. Um, it's really super convenient. This will be a new feature on all the Chaos Rods, actually. Um, and what this does for you is prevents your hooks from beating up on your line when you're bouncing across the lake. Yeah. You used to do that back in the day on the lax. Keep oh, yeah. Your... Drill all the holes right, yep. in the, right in the trigger. You can do it to your old rods. If you don't even have one of these, that's okay. Yep. Just drill it out like that. Um, but, yeah, this rod, this is actually the musky rod I've been waiting for for over 20 years. A rod that you can get in the nine foot range that is telescopic. Yep, very cool. Uh, what else is that chaos has? Yeah, yeah. there's yeah, a big we'll line up here, so we'll be jump. patient. <laughs> Let's see here, what does chaos got? What should we look at first? Here we go. Let's go it, bigger. Let's go with the big one Get your hands first. on that puppy. The Shum, Moby, what is this, a 14 inch glide bait? Um, I think it's yeah, 14. I think it's 14. I'm, it looks 14. It's bigger than a ruler. Um, yeah. Look at that thing. Gigantic. Giant. Obviously, you know, probably most waters, maybe not. But It's big. That's what we know for big. sure. And uh, apparently it has some really good action. We have not used it yet, but it is new. I'm sure you Minnesota folks will be yeah. really interested <laughs> in this. Um, and actually, you'll hear something. It okay. rattles. Let me hold the hooks. There we go. Uh... Does that matter? I don't know if it matters. No, it's just uh, another thing to think about. <laughs> but it is a wood bait, even though it rattles. It, it is a wood bait, however. So, onward. Let's see. Um, for those of you not aware, uh, Chaos Tackle has now acquired Kodiak, uh, Kodiak lures, and we've got the round nose glider here, which is your standard side to side type glider. Uh, I did notice when I threw it, you can actually get this quite deep for a glide bait. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you mostly know. they're running right on the surface, but to be yeah. able to go a little bit deeper on your glides, that's pretty cool. It's pretty heavy. It's pretty chunky. Um, super easy to work. Uh, it's kind of cool how the grub tail goes in the inside the bait like that in the back. And, of course, they have a wide array of... Should we touch on the new hooks that these oh. glide baits are going to have? Yeah, wow. Some of the sharpest hooks are being made by Chaos Tackle right now. Um, yeah. It's actually scary. We were just having this discussion that Lee might be... Taking Removing. hooks off of his baits at the shows because they're that dangerous. So that's a cool feature um, on the Chaos baits. Yeah, that's the black Trident hooks. Um, it, they're scary. Yeah. They're super so scary. So that's going to help up help hookups on all the gliders. Let's um, see what else we got. The uh, Tap Dancer. We threw this one actually quite a bit this year. Um, man, it's just the perfect little glide bait. Springtime fishing or anytime fishing when the bite's hard. Going with a little small bait like that. You almost don't need a rod to, you can just throw it with a reel. Right. Just pitch the thing out and just use your reel, just like that. And that's why I called it the tap dancer, because yep. you just barely tap it. And that thing will swoop left and right. Um, Let's see what else we got. Okay. Oh, diving rise time. Yeah. 
yeah, obviously a popular subject here. This is the Kodiak 10 inch Navin, as you can see. And this is the eight inch as well. Uh, that comes with the screw and weight feature. Um, with this particular weight, the bait is a slow rise. Um, I'm assuming this was, comes with weight too, but oh, this yes. is... Yep, we just had this. <laughs> we just had that, just that one bait. Um, I know Brian got a really nice yep. fish on the 12 inch version of this. Yeah, so um, I go to Brian's channel, Angling Anarchy. He put an absolute giant northern, northern Wisconsin fish in the boat on this bait, so. In the 12 cool. inch. 12 inch, the little, the bigger one. But We don't have a 12. No. <laughs> we got eight, 10, and they make the 12. Yep. Uh, let's I think see. that's all for the new lures this year, but we got some new colors. Uh, yeah, you've seen probably some of these on our videos. Uh, this happens to be the Perpetrator Perch uh, Custom Medusa, pearl white, with uh, perch bars, orange tail, white. And we got one of my favorite, the Ghost Walleye. This bait has served me well this year, so... What happened to um, you throwing that bait this year? <laughs> or letting it sit on the bottom. Awesomeness happened. <laughs> 53 inches yep. of awesomeness, 52 and three quarter, yep. whatever. Yep. It was a big animal. That was big. That was big. So that's very cool. I think that wraps it up for the chaos side of things. Let's see. Actually, they got one more thing here. Oh, yeah. Um, also available from Lakewood. You know, uh, you got uh, that we love our Lakewood yes. boxes. Yep. Um, they have four of the different musky tackle boxes embroidered with your with chaos tackle. Boom. <laughs> custom logo show off your chaos you know when uh wh what's it say when all chaos breaks loose there that's you go. it um onward should we go to your baits lee uh sure we can do that <laughs> let's see here um obviously uh this is not new but we're gonna have custom colors at the show finally pink finally pink. lots of requests <laughs> for pink that's awesome um nice and right Brand new color, which I'll have in multiple baits, is the uh, Poltergeist Perch. White, of course, we oh, love course. white. Yeah, so that's cool. Gold perch bars, iridescent. Uh, we've even got, look at this, <laughs> a plain wood flap tail. It works. It, it might work. <laughs> it's, a, it's a classic design. Guys were asking for it. Cool. Um, had a little bit of action, the little we actually threw it. Yep. Um, you, I think you did catch I one on two. it. Yeah. Two? Okay. <laughs> um, so, yeah, custom colored stuff. Let's dig into, though, more importantly. Okay. <laughs> the bait I am most excited about in the Lee Lures lineup, the 8-inch Leviathan. Oh, it's going to be perfect for our home water. A lot of places we fish, you know, that 10-inch is nice. But to have this little guy, this is going to be awesome. <laughs> Would it take about five casts yep. for you to almost, almost get catch that one. one on it? We actually almost got it. It ate the sucker at the same time, so that's cool. Uh, how many weights are going to be with yours? Well, the thing about this bait, and I'll tell you, there's a little bit of weight already uh, inserted inside, so it's pre-weighted, uh, but obviously not with much weight, so it will be fairly buoyant with no weights. But it comes with a three-weight system, and it comes with a two ounce weight, which is the biggest. The two ounce weight will actually make the bait sink. So, husky jerkin, <laughs> boom. basically. You can fish a dive and rise bait basically is about as deep as you want because this bait will sink. Um, so you take that weight out and that, those just screw in. And by the way, I would highly recommend putting a little light uh, Loctite on that thread so you don't lose your weights, have a screwdriver, put them in, whatever. Um, but so you pop out the two ounce and you put in a one and a half, which is in that one, and that creates a suspending bait. So that bait is going to hang basically right in their face. Um, now, nice. now you're talking husky jerk. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, let's see here. And you can pop that out and put the one ounce in, and then you're going to have a slow rising bait, probably about this rate or so, I would guess. And you can pop that out, fish it with no weight, and then you can pop right through the weeds you know these are yeah. amazingly weedless yep. surprisingly um, this happens to be a new color this is uh <laughs> nuclear bluegill yeah i like that one that's, that's pretty cool. hot for those of you who like bright colors and we got the pol poltergeist perch as well it's scary it's, it's scary. frightening <laughs> it's poltergeist perch <laughs> so yeah the eight inch leviathan i will have in the auto clear finish by the way uh, I also have some 10-inch uh, Levi's at the show as well. 
um yeah this this is the one i'm mm -hmm. pretty pumped about absolutely what else we got um okay no this is not new but the flap nine you i have some <laughs> i will i have some trust me i i wish i could keep up uh the number of reports of monster fish on these things stupid it really is the I results mean, that i uh, mean a fish over 45 inches everywhere yeah the thing just is a big fish magnet I heard of uh, three fish over 50 by one angler in, in an afternoon or in, an, in one, I think it was two nights two actually, nights, two yeah. in one night and one the next night, uh, three over 50. Yeah. So a um, <laughs> few new different colors coming, but everybody wants this color. I wonder for why. For some <laughs> weird reason. And by the way, Robbie, who dressed you today? <laughs> uh, this guy right here, uh, new Lee Lures hoodies. Are these bright? They're bright. These are, I've never seen a hoodie like this. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty crazy. Got the L over here on your hood. Um, here, I'll model it for you, folks. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Both yeah. sides. We figured it'd be nice to match while we while we do this video. Yeah, you know, because <laughs> then we're like Cause pro we're team. team. We're teammates, so yeah. <laughs> team that. Lee Lures. Yep. <laughs> uh, no, but all, in seri all seriousness, this is a uh, performance fleece hoodie. Um, it's as you can see it's got like an embossed pattern that yeah. just kind of breaks it up yeah. and it's not uh, too heavy not too light it's kind of the perfect in between what's nice is the sleeves dry out quick you know the performance hoodie type stuff um, super lightweight but yeah they're they're definitely uh, you know a high-end high performance hoodie so yeah these will be at the shows and I've also got them on the website as well so Go make check sure them out there boom check that out I'll we'll leave a link. <laughs> um, also, on the one other thing here, custom I'm excited colors. About those. So I have had a, these in the past. This is the Auto Clear version of the Water Chopper XL. This is Circus Perch pattern. Uh, if you want to run rougher water, yep. you want a bigger profile, uh, this thing really excels over the regular size chopper. Um, yeah, no, for those conditions, it's an awesome running bait for sure. Cool. Here you go, Yeah, I'll play with this one. I uh, got one more thing here. Okay. New from Lee Lures will be spinner baits. Willow Leaf spinner baits. Got uh, two different sizes. Got a seven Willow Leaf blade with a four Colorado. And that's a one and a half ounce model. And then also have a one ounce model, which equals as a nice big bass bait right, as well. Basically, yeah. Pike, dogfish. <laughs> Everything. Uh, take your pick. Uh, that's, like I said, the one ounce model. It's got a number five willow and also has a number three kicker blade. Really, it's like the perfect spinner bait. Yep. True running. Um, that's pretty much, that's what I call it, the perfect spinner bait. <laughs> so two sizes, got those deals there. Uh, those are not on the website, but they will be at the shows this season. There you have it. That's uh, what's new from Lee Lures. Moving so. on. Let's go dig into, we just released a video for this bait. The Shredder from TNA Tackle. This is not a Shredder one. here. What is awesome about this bait is, the one thing about the Angry Dragon, it runs a little bit deep, and you have to kind of uh, burn it a little faster to get it up high, but the Shredder with that blade, you can go slow and you can run that thing high, which is just awesome. What's wrong? Every bait works if you got a blade on it, yeah. so. <laughs> There's a blade spinning. Um, I know this bait has been notorious, especially in clear water, of getting lots of follows. Um, you got this thing slapping them right in the face. Yeah. How could they say How no? Could, yeah, no. We didn't get to use it very much this year, but um, there's, I'm excited to use it more in 2020. Yeah, I know those guys uh, uh, brought it to Lake of the Woods and had... Uh, terrific right everybody's action. throwing bucktails out there using something different like this definitely will excel uh, this is actually a ta custom color the perpetrator perch Ooh. nice and orange like and we got a ta walleye as well oh wow yeah. i did not <laughs> know yep. that was even <laughs> happening yep. so we got two custom colors from today's angler at tna so check that out look at that gold dragon that is just some of the gold blade stuff. some of their colors are just absolutely awesome so I like what these guys do, you know, because they make it as nice and aesthetically as oh, yeah. possible. Absolutely. Beautiful baits. Beautiful baits. And that hold together. I mean, there's a lot of time into this oh, yeah. bait. Tying I mean, all that. the different sections and everything. 
Just even this wire piece, you know, that small wire piece it just takes up. Heavy duty, hard working people make an awesome product. There you have it, today's Anger Walleye. Cool. Moving on to bite back baits. Uh, this is gonna be fun this year. <laughs> yes, spinner baits. This spinner is baits. gonna be the year of spinner yes, baits. Yes, it I, will be. <laughs> I, I see this happening. Wanna, oh yeah, I wanna, guess I'll grab hold that. that one. Is that the deep one? This is the yep. one ounce model. Oh, okay. And on that's ounce. on a one ounce head. And here we go. The spinner bait, the trilogy spinner bait. This thing, you can fish it like a jerk bait. You can burn the thing. You can uh, let it fall, and this blade will actually spin perfectly. Well, it's going down. On the fall it's as crazy. well. <laughs> Back old school when I used to fish a lot of deep weed edges with spinner baits. Uh, even late in the year, like November, I would catch fish drop fishing spinner baits. That's crazy. I think it's I think it's going to be good. Also new new this year from Biteback is a new blade design. The supersonic blade, he calls it. Yep. A little bit lighter, you can run baits a little bit higher um, with these kind of blades. It's normal for them to run a little bit deeper, but yeah, he's, he's figured it out. <laughs> he's figured it out. If you look closely, there's actually cutaways to each blade on there, and that makes the blade lighter, of course, taking metal away um, with the same size blade, so yep. it's it's going to run shallower. So, so that's cool. They're also going to, we don't have one here, they're going to do that on their inlines as well. So you'll be able to fish the standard trilogy with the that, supersonic blade. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Dude, Scott is already, always coming always up. Always tinkering, yep. <laughs> yeah, man. I'm like, just keep making baits. Right. And yeah, he just keeps coming up with new stuff. So that so. is awesome. Um, that's pretty cool. What we got for 2020 here, um, definitely an awesome lineup of baits. A lot of new things. Custom colors, a lot of all different kinds colors. of stuff. Man, gotta that's... love new baits, musky fishing. That's that's the beauty about this time of year. Um, you're going to these shows and you're buying baits and you know exactly where you're gonna be throwing them um, once open water comes, so. Yeah, I guess for me, if it would come down to it, the most exciting thing, other than maybe my Levi. Yes. <laughs> uh, no, no, never mind. mind. <laughs> yeah, this, this rod is gonna change the game of musky fishing, um, hands down. Uh, the competition will be following yeah. suit. Yep. I guarantee crazy. it's going to happen. Um, to have a rod that light, 25 to 30 percent lighter than the previous rods, which were already right. light. Right. Right. So yeah, we encourage you to pick up one of these rods and one of the original assault sticks and just compare it. Just hold it and have your mind blown because it is absolutely crazy. Even if you don't want to spend the money on one, just come and pick one up, right. just so you know what is actually available yep. out there. It's very cool. So, I don't know, I guess, uh, yes, we will be at the Chicago Muskie Expo this coming weekend. Uh, certainly looking forward to seeing all you familiar faces and new faces Absolutely. as well. Uh, make sure if you haven't yet, please click the subscribe button. I know there's a lot of people out there that still- Yeah, still haven't done that. <laughs> have not subscribed. Uh, make sure to hit us up on uh, Instagram and uh, also TikTok as well. TikTok, we got TikTok. So there you have it. There's a quick little run through of what's new for 2020, uh, what stuff we'll be using this coming season. Thank and you guys for watching. All right. We'll see you we on the next one. See you in the next video. <laughs> Thanks for seeing you at the show.